Okay, so what we're looking at today is the CyberClean. It says touch, clean and enjoy. It's a cleaning compound. So, if we have a look, you can see that you can clean uh, keyboards, grills, devices, and it claims to kill at least 99.9% .9 of germs as well. So let's get some out of the packet and see what it's like. Okay, so here it is. Here's the cleaning compound. It's quite a stickyish material, but not sticky in a gooey kind of way. It's got like the same sensation maybe of silly putty that I probably used to play with as a child. It's quite enjoyable actually to play with, but there you go. So it says what you do is you press it on a device. So here I've got a phone. Press it on the device like so. And it actually cleans any of the ones in there. Here is my laptop. I'm going to do the same thing. Just press it on. Pull it away. And it cleans any of the pieces of dirt in between the keyboards. Now, the good thing about it is that obviously because it does kill 99% of all germs, this means if things like, I don't know, I sneezed and then started using the keyboard without washing my hands in between, which I know is a little bit dirty, um, it would kill those germs on the keyboard, which ordinary dust and things might not do. It's also advantageous because it's not watery, so it's not going to cause any problems to the electrics neither. As you can see, looking quite clean there. There's a little bit of dirt in between there. Let's see if we can get that off with it. There you go. Dirt's gone from in there. It does have, if you can see, quite a sheen to it. A little bit sticky, like I said, but that's to pick up the dirt and everything in there. It doesn't specify on the packet whether it's a one-time use or whether it could be used for most pull appliances. I'm guessing you peel off as much as you need. Um, it does have a little bit of a smell to it, but nothing that's too overly powering. But yeah, it seems to work pretty well at cleaning my laptop anyway.